So the craziest thing ever happened to me last night. The craziest and weirdest thing ever happened. And I cannot stop laughing about it. I was literally just chilling at the food court at the mall, eating my food, and then some girl came up to me and started screaming. She's like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. And then I was just like, in my head, I'm like, oh, okay, just another fan, I'm gonna take a picture with her. And I'm like, oh, what's up, you watch my video? She's like, oh my god, it's Rico from Hannah Montana. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. And in my head, I'm like, wait, does she even know that I'm FaZe Rugger? Does she legit think that I'm Rico from Hannah Montana? And she's actually freaking out, like, causing a scene, and everyone's, like, looking, and I'm sitting there, like, <laughs> and she's like, oh my god, can I please get a picture? Can I please get a picture? And I played along as Rico from Hannah Montana. I was like, oh yeah, sure. Um, did you like my acting back in the day? Like, I pretended to be Rico from Hannah Montana, and it's funny because, like, everybody, everybody thought I was Rico from from Hannah Montana in middle school and like the start of high school. I'm gonna be showing you guys some pictures from back in the day. Um, I have this like album right here of like baby pictures, you know. Um, I showed some pictures in one video like a couple weeks ago and a lot of people want to see like a full on video of my old pictures and stuff like that. But I basically took a picture with her and I'm like, do you know who Faze Rug is? And she's like, what? That's so crazy. Like in my head, I'm like, that's so crazy. I'm like, oh, I, I don't know. I was just wondering, but it's really nice to meet you. Thank you for coming up to me. I actually got mistaken for Rico from Hannah Montana, but it makes no sense because he looks like this now. What happened to the old Rico, man? Okay, so I'm gonna tell you guys a little funny story. I actually did get mistaken a lot for Rico from Hannah Montana, and I'd always play along with that. I'd always be like, oh yeah, I worked with Miley and Hannah Montana, you know, oh wait, they're one person, but you know, the show, Miley, Hannah Montana, best of both worlds. I used to be a huge fan of Hannah Montana, you guys all know that, and I don't know why I'm even talking about this in a video, but it's just really funny. I thought of this video idea because of that one crazy fangirl that came up to me thinking that I was actually Rico from Hannah Montana, and then it like brought back a lot of memories, how people were, would always call me Rico from Hannah Montana. And I'm gonna show you guys one embarrassing picture. Please do not screenshot it and do not post it anywhere. Me saying that, me just saying that, you guys are gonna screenshot and post it everywhere. I already know it, but I'm gonna show you guys a picture of this is me in, I believe, seventh grade. I'm not sure, but just, just prepare yourselves. I posted it on Twitter like a couple weeks ago, but I was a huge fan of Hannah Montana. Yep, that was me with Miley and Hannah Montana all over my freaking wall. I'm just casually sitting there eating cereal and my mom comes up to me and takes a picture. I freaking look like a serial killer in this picture. Like, why do I have all these pictures of Miley? Let me tell you guys what I used to do. I used to get these magazines sent to my house every month and it would always come with this huge poster of Miley and then I'd go through the magazine and any picture of Miley or Hannah Montana I would cut out with scissors, tape it on my wall and start my collection. But for real guys, I'm gonna show you guys another picture that I actually looked so much like Rico from Hannah Montana. I actually got asked it so many times in middle school and I would play along with it. I'd be like, yeah, that's me. Um, I worked with Miley last week, you know. Um, she forced me to put all these pictures on the wall. Guys, just find me in this frame real quick. Look at me! Oh my god, I look like a freaking clown with that hair. That was 8th grade right there. Can you believe that? And I'm gonna show you guys another picture. I can't look at old pictures of myself without, like, cringing. Alright, this is my graduation picture, high school. Wow, I was... I was one evil little kid. How nice. What a way to spend my free time drawing on my teacher's faces. Oh, this was my kindergarten teacher. Why did I draw on her? So as you guys can tell, I, I kind of didn't like this teacher, but that's me right there in the yellow. But yeah, I kind of just didn't really like that teacher. She was really mean to me. All right, so I found this picture on my Instagram. I'm gonna put it up on the screen. As you guys can see, I played Rico from Hannah Montana for about three years and then I had a replacement take my place. I actually played on Hannah Montana for a couple years. I got to meet Miley, um, it was really fun. She's really cool and all, whatever, but uh, I decided to step away from acting and take YouTube more serious, so now I'm here. I just can't get over this picture. Like, this picture needs to be burned right now. I'm gonna play some old clips from my acting career. I hope you guys enjoy. Let me know what you guys think of my acting. What happened? They were robbed. Look, third one down, just below the red ones. They're gone. And yeah, now you guys know I played as Rico from Hannah Montana. Moving away from that subject, I have this book, this 
album of old pictures of myself, like baby pictures, pictures of when I was in elementary school, middle school, stuff like that. And a lot of people actually want to see a video like this where I go through my old pictures with my brother and stuff like that. But I'm gonna show you guys something. So, all right, do you guys see this scar right here? Right here. I have had that scar my whole entire life, basically since I was, I believe three when me and my brother were playing around as kids and uh, I hit my head on the table. This was in my Draw My Life video. But here I found a picture with something over my eye right here. And it was Christmas time, so look at this. That's me, the little guy right there with that fat freaking thing on my eye. All because of Brandon, all because of him. That on my eye is this scar, it's crazy. All right, so I don't know how, I don't know how, but me and my brother have freaking naked pictures of ourselves in the bathtub. Because we used to take baths together, and I guess my mom just like took pictures of us. I can't show you guys because we're freaking naked. Little rug, that's me. Look at how tiny I was in elementary school. This was kindergarten. Look at how small I was. I think I had a crush on all three girls, like I liked any girl in elementary school. Crazy thing is, I remember all their names. So this is Kaylani, that's Caroline, and this is Yui. I freaking remember them, of course. And we got me and Brandon right there. Oh, I miss the elementary school days, man. I wish I was a kid. Honestly, a lot of people want to grow up, but growing up low-key sucks. You have responsibilities, you go through stress, like there's a lot more. Uh, I don't know. Just enjoy your time as a kid. If you're not an adult yet, please just enjoy your time. Mama Rug with me and Brandon. Yeah. Man, I love going through these albums. Like, it brings back such great memories. Okay, not gonna lie though, I was one ugly kid. Like, like just look at me. Yikes. Yikes. I honestly still can't get over the fact that I got recognized in public as Rico from Hannah Montana. I cannot believe that. Like, I don't really look like him now. So that's why I was so surprised. Maybe if I still look like him, but I don't think I look like him anymore. But back in the day, based off of those pictures that I showed you guys, don't you guys think that I looked exactly like Rico? It was insane. Like, the amount of times I'd get mistaken for him, even in public back in the day, sometimes I'd have little kids come up to me and say, oh my God, are you Rico from Hannah Montana? And I'm just like, yeah, that's me. Like, this is what he looks like now. How did he get from this to this? Rico, man, why? All right, so this is how my video was set up. I moved my monitor from here to there so I could get a background like this with the one mil plaque and my closet's just back there. But I think that's like a nicer scenery for making videos like this where I wanna sit down and talk or like reaction videos, stuff like that. What do you guys think? My one mil plaque in the background. The other one was like this, so I'd have to like close my door all the time. One mil plaque would still be in it, but this is a lot more cleaner and I think it's nicer, so let me know what you guys think. But please, I wanna hear your guys' opinions in the comment section. Did you guys think I looked like Rico from Hannah Montana back in the day after showing you guys all those pictures and telling you guys about my experiences? My teacher would actually think that I was Rico from Hannah Montana and like, we'd fool the whole class. It's insane, but it's something funny to look back at my whole life, like looking at old pictures and saying people used to think I was Rico from Hannah Montana, making a video about it. So I do hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, please be sure to drop a like. Thank you guys so much for the support. I have been a little bit stressed over the holidays, which sucks because it's the holidays, it's almost Christmas. No one should be stressed. It sucks, but um, your guys' support really gets me through the day. Like. Um, even if you just go on my Twitter and tweet at me just saying, hey, I hope you're feeling better, or hey, like, uh, I enjoyed the video today, or hey, I hope you had a good day, something like that will literally just change my mood, and it'll make me happy. So, again, thank you guys for being there for me all the time, and I do appreciate it. I also wanted to let you guys know that I'm going to be doing a huge follow spree on Instagram because I want to keep up with you guys, and I want to do more follow sprees and follow you guys make your day. So please go on my Instagram, at rugface, follow me if you haven't. And like my latest pictures, and then I might be posting one today, and just bang the like button. Just double tap your screen, like it, comment, begging me to follow you. I will be going through the comments and likes today on like a lot of my pictures, but mostly the one that I'm gonna be posting today. So please don't miss it. I'm gonna be doing a follow spree, and um, if I don't follow you, don't be upset because I do follow sprees a lot and like one day it might be your lucky day. Trust me. In any way to communicate with you guys, I will do it. So thank you guys so much. Hope you guys all have a great rest of your day. And other than that, it's been Rug and I'm out. Peace.